So by now, most of you should know, my name is Yusuf Scott, and I want to welcome you to the Southern Easy Forex University. All right, so by now, most of you should know that my name is Yusuf Scott, and I'm the guy behind the Southern Music Forge University. Also, consider the Forge Gold online. If you have not yet figured it out, please go to theforgegold.com, and you'll, you'll truly understand why. All right? You'll realize, you'll comprehend why they consider the Forge Gold. Now, listen, as I always tell you guys, I'm very thankful to have you guys here. You know, this weekend, you guys have plenty of time to analyze the charts, you know, mark up your charts, and get ready for tomorrow's open at, at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, I wanted to create this video today um, for those of you who scalp on the Forex market, all right? You know, when I sit back and I think about the market and I think about scalpers and how they're introduced to the market, I realize that like 90% of scalpers, they're making this one mistake, all right? And I want to share that with you guys and hopefully you guys can think about the angle that I choose to come at you in this video so that you can make better choices. Okay? Now, for starters, as a Forex mentor, I do not train my students to scout the market first. I believe that they should be learning how to look at the market from a long-term perspective and then learn to scout the market. Now, here's my reason why. All right, so as a long-term trader, you're able to see the market from a, a bird's eye view or an aerial view. All right? You take an aerial view of the market and you're able to look down on the market, just like if you're in a city, if you're like in New York City, you're looking down on the city, and you can see the ins and outs, you can see the roads going in and out of the city, all right? But when you're on the street level, taking a, a more narrow uh, view of the market or of the city, you can only see as far as the road is gonna take you, as far north or as far as straight in front of you is gonna take you, all right? So you have a limitation on what you can see. So my theory is, and my thinking and my philosophy is, Learn how to see the market from an aerial view, the big picture, so that you can know that, hey, look, if I'm wherever I am in the market, if I know the market is going in one direction, then if I master the long term, you know, I can crush the market on both sides. All right. So that's my thinking. Now, one of the things that I, that I would have to say is when it, you know, when it comes to being a scalper, all right, when it comes to being a scalper, um, you know, and really any, any trader, you should be mastering how and when and where and why all of those, you should be mastering getting into the market, finding a good entry, okay? Now, I want you guys to take some notes here, okay? Your, your thing should be mastering your entry, just like if you're a long-term trader, if you're a day trader or a scalper, you should be mastering your entry, all of which I teach my students how to do. All right, so if you're mastering your entry and if you get into a scalp and if for some reason, remember, think about it, think about it. If you're into the market and, you're, and you're, you see the market from a bird's eye view, aerial view, you should be going with the momentum, okay? You should be going with the momentum and you should, you should be confident about your trade, okay? So unfortunately, What's going on is people are just getting into the market at random. And that type of trading is causing you to lose. Okay? So I would say 90%, and if I, if I look at the charts, um, I would have to say 90% of, of traders, they fail because they're not looking at the market from a, an, an aerial view. All right? And then on top of that, their entries are bad. Really, the, the issue is their entries. Your entry sucks. That's just what it is. It sucks. You have a bad entry. So once you, once you develop or you learn to follow some type of um, uh, strategy for entering in on a market, I have to tell you, your, your, your trading would improve. Okay? Now, some of you may say, well, I don't really know how to enter in on a market. I just go with the momentum of how the candle looks when I'm looking at the chart. Well, that's, that's, a, that's a recipe for disaster in itself. So this is what I'm thinking. Now, I don't want to tell you guys, like, we have the low-risk scalper strategy, but these are just common sense 
uh, ideas that I think everyone should have, okay? So if you, if you can see the market from a long term, then you should know the direction you should be trading in, all right? Furthermore, if you have a solid entry on the market, okay, how do you determine when your entry is not as good as you thought it was? Well, my thinking is this. If I'm, if I'm trading the market or scalping the market in the direction of the momentum, then nine times out of 10, my trade is going to stay in the positive, all right? It's going to stay positive. Now, in, as a scalper, you know, the market will fluctuate. It's going to fluctuate. So, so you may get, you may not stay in profit the entire time. It may pull you out of, the, out of the money, you know, once or twice or whatever it may be, depending on the market. But overall, remember, aerial view, you should fall into profit and stay into profit. Okay, now I'll take it a step further. If, if, if that's what, if, if, you're, if you're thinking is to scout the market, get a better entry, okay? Get a better entry and, you know, don't deviate from that. The discipline, the way you become successful is by you finding that entry and you rolling with it, okay? Um, don't go back and forth, don't, you know, start wrestling with yourself about, you know, ideals on uh, what you should do. If you have a set of rules, follow those rules and that's it. All right. So, you know, hopefully this makes sense to you guys um, because, you know, having having a solid entry is going to really change the game. It's going to change the game. If you know the direction the market is moving in overall and you're focused on that, then chances are you're going to find and realize profit, all right? For those of you who are scalping the market, maybe you need to learn how to trade long-term first. You know, change up, change up what you're doing. You know, because everyone who's in front of you saying, hey, I want to teach you how to trade or trade on the forex market, it's, it's not going to work for everybody. I mean, sometimes you have to, my thinking is, I can't control my students, what they, what they want and what they do, but if I can educate you before you join and I tell you, listen, you know, perhaps you may want to see the market and comprehend the market from a long-term perspective. If you can comprehend the market and you can make sense out of what I'm telling you, then you'll have time to scout the market. You know, I'll teach you how to trade long-term and scout the market at the same time. All right? Hit them from both sides. Okay? So, hopefully this made sense to you guys. Um, listen, I really appreciate all the love, all the support. Uh, remember that we do have our coronavirus uh, relief promotion still going on. This thing is still active. Still a lot of people joining. But I want to make sure you guys know, if I don't mention it, don't think that it's not on, that you know you, you do not need any type of coupon when you go to the website, um, sodoneasy4x.com uh, forward slash memberships. The prices that are on that website where you click and you have the drop down, those prices have already been adjusted to reflect the promotion. All right, so just know that. So uh, listen, really appreciate you guys, all the support, all the love. Remember, um, you know, they consider me the Forex Go for a reason. I can talk Forex for days, all right? And you guys need to have the same level of confidence, all right? And listen, as always, stay healthy, stay safe, stay prayed up in these uncertain times, all right? Peace, everyone. Peace.